Well, good morning, everyone, and welcome to Thursday's Thought for the Day. Yesterday, we heard the angel announcing to the shepherds that they have good news. Today, from Luke chapter 2, verse 11, we hear exactly what that good news is. Today, in the town of David, a saviour has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. The angel brings good news of the birth of a baby. Now, a baby being born is always good news. But the nature of this baby makes this particularly special. See how the baby Jesus is described by the angel. The saviour, the messiah, the lord. The combination of titles present here is unique. They do not appear together in any other New Testament text. Jesus is the saviour. He's a deliverer that Zechariah's song in chapter 1 spoke of, bringing salvation from our enemies. And we know now that Jesus will ultimately save us from the enemies of sin, death, Satan. Jesus is the Christ, the promised Messiah, the anointed king, the one who has promised to come in the line of David. It's no surprise, therefore, that this saviour is born in Bethlehem, the town of David. And the angel also speaks of Jesus as Lord. And that's a title used of God himself. He's the one who rightly demands our obedience and submission. And what's striking about Jesus being described as Lord here is what has just happened in the chapter. It was an angel of the Lord who appeared to the shepherds. It was a glory of the Lord that shone around the shepherds. And after the shepherds have seen Jesus, they acknowledge in verse 15 what the Lord has told us about. Amazingly, this newborn baby has divine identity. Not only was his child sent from the Lord, but he's the Lord himself. Not only had the Lord of heaven acted to rescue his people from sin and shame, he himself had come to earth and dwelt among us in our own flesh and blood. In Jesus, divinity and humanity come together. Jesus existed before he was conceived and born. What happened that night was a birth of Jesus as human, but it was not the beginning of the person, God the Son. In love, God the Son came to earth to save us. And in love, Jesus reaches out to each one of us personally. You see, the angel declares to the shepherds, a saviour has been born to you. And we're called to identify with the shepherds and realise a saviour has been born to us. So how will you respond? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we praise you that Jesus, the King, the Lord, has come to be our Saviour. That's such good news and we praise you for that. In Jesus' name. Amen. Have a good Thursday. See you tomorrow.